you know, it's special not only because I could tell my teammates were trying to get me those goals in the first half, but my family was here, great crowd, uh, great team performance. You know, I couldn't say, I can't say enough about how much I look up to Mia and how amazing the record that she set was. Um, you know, my teammates have put me in all different kinds of positions to score goals, and I can't say it enough, and I really through and through believe it in my heart. Um, I'm only as good as my teammates allow me to be. And yes, I score a lot of goals, and yes, I put myself in positions to score goals, but they do too. And, you know, I can't thank my teammates enough. Cheney, Pino, um, Alex, that fourth goal, you know, it's a special night. It was surreal when it was happening. You know, I thought when I missed the breakaway, okay, maybe it's not going to happen, but, you know, my teammates were relentless in putting me in those positions. Honestly, we're always looking for each other. Abby, after she scored three, she was like, okay, can we please get it to you now? Can we pass it to you? Let's go. And I was like, no, we'll just continue passing it to you. But we're always looking for each other up top, um, making runs for each other. Uh, so I think that we played well together. We played um, selflessly, and I think uh, it showed in the success of the team. I really wasn't expecting she was going to get a hat trick to break the Chase Mia, so I thought we were going to be good doing the Chase Mia thing for a lot longer, but unbelievable. She just like turns it on in the biggest games if she needs to. Um, I don't feel like we were really forcing it at all. She was just able to freaking get out there and get those goals. Well, my teammates know me super well at halftime. They were like, you are such an extremist, you know, you can, you're all or nothing. When you want to do something, you just go ahead and do it. I mean, she's a, a thorough professional. She is an outstanding professional, outstanding team player. And, and to break Mia's record in itself is a great achievement. You know, it's one great player breaking the record of another great player. And, um, and the way she did it tonight, I think, was, was outstanding. I mean, just to score four goals in about 20 minutes, the way she scored the goals, the way she went about playing tonight, it, it was like you, you couldn't have scripted it any better. From the very beginning of you know, battling and fighting just to get that start, to get on the field, and then her domination and, you know, playing with her, playing against her. She's an unbelievable player, person, friend, teammate. You know, I can't ask for a better teammate, you know, to be on the field with her and, and watch her grow and now, you know, taking over taking over the world. And FIFA Player of the Year last year, um, she's on top of her game, and I'm glad to be part of it. You know, I've looked up to Abby for so many years. Uh, she's, she's a great leader for this team, and to be able to be a part of this memory looking forward and um, breaking this record. Uh, Abby completely deserves it and I'm really happy for her. If I were to end my career right now, uh, I would have done it before breaking. That's how much I respect I have for Mia, how much she's done for me personally, how much she's doing for even Alex Morgan still. Um, you know, this isn't a personal thing. Mia wants players to break, break her records. Uh, I now want Alex to break mine and I just told Alex, you better do it in much less time than I did. That number is going to keep growing. Abby is not going anywhere. So uh, she's going to crush Mia's record and continue on. Uh, and we'll see when come the World Cup time what number she has then because I see it just keep getting, just continuing to get higher. She's an amazing leader, especially, you know, all these years playing with her. Be on the field in the presence of her tonight and breaking this record and how she did it in style. You know, four goals. You know, broke it in, what, 30 minutes, three goals. She was just on top of her game today. You know she was going after it, but it's just an honor to be able to be on the field there and then pass her the captain's band in a game like this. Great game. You know, obviously a fairy tale game from Abby's perspective and the team. Uh, so that was a great way to start the game. But I was really delighted with how we played tonight, the way we defended and the way we kept possession of the ball. Uh, our movement was great. The pressure we put on the ball was fantastic. And it was a kind of performance that, you know, we talked about that an American team should put on. And we put all the parts together tonight. It just kind of clicked. I think we kind of clicked through the midfield and we were able to keep possession from an early, early part in the game and that kind of carried through. Um, getting an early goal, I think, helped as well, kind of settle things down. The crowd was amazing tonight, playing in your home state. You know, there's a lot of Jersey girls on this team. I think we represent well and uh, put on a great performance tonight and better to break a record in New Jersey and in front of all these fans and I'm proud of Abby.